guys, this is Ian. I uh, just thought I'd give a quick uh, sneak preview of my next model um, to be released. And I've gone vehicle again. This time it's a tractor. So this is um, essentially because my my son, my youngest son, is absolutely mad keen on tractors. We live in a fairly rural area and uh, tractors are everywhere. Uh, they include in the sometimes parts on our estate on, on people's drives. So um, he's, he's really keen on them, loves them. So I just thought I'd, uh, I'd make this make tractor as the, the model. I came up with this. This is uh, a multi part model again, and it prints kind of in this orientation on the printer. You'll see that I've dropped this one on the floor and made a bit of a mess of it. Um, I'm currently debating whether I've got enough me, uh, enough. Noble Blue to uh, to print another one, but um, I think that I've got to the point now where I'm fairly happy with the model. The um, the idea, as I say, it comes in various parts. These parts will be glued together, so the the roof fits on the top of the cab, and the cab glues on there as well. So those those will glue together. These do um, the wheels. And the axle, so the axle goes all the way through. You print that as a separate part. You print the the wheels and the tires, uh, or the wheel hubs, should I say, and the tires and the wheel hubs screw in left-handed thread into the axles. And there's a there's a left and a right version of the tire because the the tread needs to go on it. Then the front, the front wheels there are very similar, and the the hubs again screw in there. I've also made a tool. It's a, a kind of wheel brace that you use to, to turn around that so that'll be in the in the release model as well so that that was just a, as i say a quick preview i'll obviously at some point be printing lots and lots of these um, this is obviously as is my want is printed in filamentum and the the roof and the the main body are in noble blue the cab is in crystal clear iceland blue i will probably reprint that and make it a little bit uh, Bit more opaque so um, you can see the the infill i actually quite like that you can see the vertical lines from the infill so that's with honeycomb infill from simplify 3d and um, I'll, as i say i'll probably reprint it so that's a bit more opaque on this one and the wheels the axles that you can't see but are in there they're in traffic black and traffic white for the wheel hubs so look out for this model when I publish it. It will be available on Thingiverse, on My Mini Factory, on Cult 3D and on Pinshape as usual. And will also as usual be a free download. Uh, as I say, it prints in multiple parts. And uh, I hope you print it. And if you do, don't forget, tag me in social media. I'd love to see them, the models that you print. And um, also obviously on any of the, uh, the file sharing sites that I, I, that I just mentioned. Um, be, I'd be more than more than over the moon uh, to see people on there. It is one of these things when you uh, you come up with a model like this, if somebody else prints it, it really does make you make you quite happy. So as usual, I would really appreciate it if you, uh, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And, and if you like this, this content that I'm producing, then please subscribe to the channel. I would really appreciate that. Uh, one little, little last thing on this model, by the way. Look, it's, uh, it's got a hookup point. So there may well be some trailers at some point.